Check, 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 check it, check it, check one, two, check it, check it, check one, two, three, check it, check it. We're back again doing it. Boys and girls, ladies and gents, welcome back. Glad you made it. It's another social production. We're doing it on April the 5th. It is Wednesday in the 23s, baby. You're from Toronto, wherever you're at. Hope you're doing well. If you're joining me, if it's your first time, buckle up, buckle down. Where can you find these videos? Again, Mondays, Wednesdays, Fridays on Instagram. Follow me there if you like. Subscribe on YouTube for the full-length videos. Check out patreon.com slash Rob Sadry. We rock and roll around here. Have some fun three times a week. Talk about everything and nothing under the sun. And spend time together as a familia, as a syndicate, as a global syndicate spanning from all regions all corners it's a round world we live in but you know what i mean when i say corners square that circle baby let's do it we're gonna have some fun today it's wednesday oh man it is man it is wednesday i'm excited wherever you are i hope you are doing well let me get a sip of this bad boy coffee right here i'm feeling good i hope you're feeling good we're just gonna hang loose, baby. We're just gonna hang loose. And we're gonna have some fun. Boy, you that don't be a fool boy. Don't be a fool boy. You want to you want don't be a fool boy. But, you know, don't be a fool boy. Or or don't be a serious a fool boy. You use a serious a fool boy. Um, sometimes it does work with the gals and them too. It's He's a serious a fool boy with the gals and the gals and the fools and the boys and the gals. Or something along those lines. Pussy scented car air refresheners. That's what I'm coming up with. That's where I'm like, you know what? It, it's pussy scented car air refresheners. Why not? Because, uh, yeah, everybody can do regular strawberries. Anybody can do peaches and cream, son. Anybody can do grapes, anybody can do alpine, anybody can do whatever else, like, you know, black diamond ice. It'll just be a little black tree with diamond ice on or something. Or maybe you got one of those, like, maybe it's a plug-in. It's a plug-in air freshener for your car. What does it smell like? Lavender? Vanilla? You want you to be a vanilla? Don't be a fool, boy. Yeah. Get that. Pussy scented car air refreshener all around the world because that's what it sends a message to. You. And again, maybe if maybe this is probably not for everyone, but if you're like of age, maybe fucking single, male, female, vag scented car air refreshners, putting it in there, and then it's summertime, the heat is hitting your car, you're blasting the AC, and it's just you're getting wafts wafts you have people sitting in your car they think that you're the type that you know and you don't need to be let the air refreshener do the heavy lifting for you that's what i'm coming up with if it's not been patented we're patenting it right now and i'm i'm so good at patenting things right on this we've patented so many we patent the patent baby that's what we do or we could we put it down we put it we get it cemented once it's written in stone once it's etched out in stone and cement, it's concrete. Don't be a fool boy, you know? Put it down in writing. It's, uh, bring a little contract. Bring a little, bring your lawyers. Bring the, bring a litigation. It's time to litigate, baby. And you know how we run them, we run them, you know, I, I'm not a lawyer or nothing, but all the work that I do in the lawyering business is free boner. I said it. Boys and girls, ladies and gents, it is. Because that's what it is. You want to be like, oh, have a seat at my car. It's strawberry. Ooh. Or incented car air refresher. Boring. Boring. It's 2023. All right. One year we'll come out with the vag scented car refreshers. And then next year we'll, we'll see how the, you know, maybe we'll put like, maybe because that's half the market, baby. We'll, maybe we'll put like, ball sack scented car error you're like why would you want why why wouldn't you have to half the population has always been down with the scent of the balls but oh everybody wants to be like oh you know keep it for the but open a car door smells like balls now that's a fellow or a lady you can get behind or in front of or at least you know side by sit sit right beside each other you know what i mean it's uh you're a passenger in this car now baby 
just because it's like and originally this is what i've heard originally i've heard that you get perfumes and fragrances and sometimes they got to go and it's like it's it's kind of like music it has notes it has oh a little bit of this a little bit of that earthy musky a little bit of you know something that smells like the woods something that smells like it's burning something that smells like the human body though that's you know they say they get a little bit of the human body odor into the fragrances so that because that's what it is you're, you're beside some you, you smell something sweet you smell something a little bit cool a little bit warm but there is a note in there there's a little teeny tiny note that human element well we're reducing all the extras and just going pure human element you know because that's what what are we doing around here what do we do if we're going to be like because that's what that's why you got like that's the problem you don't see too many people these days sniffing butts you don't see it i'm a little bit upset I've had it up to somewhere with this situation, but it's time to change things around, ladies and gentlemen. It is time to change things around. Because that's that's what it is, baby. You want somebody just like, you know, right around your crotch. Because when dogs do it, you're like, oh, what a cute dog. Maybe we're not as inviting as we used to be. I'm just putting it out there. Putting ideas out there. Putting ideas everywhere. We're doing it, baby. It is. It's the season. It's the season. It's spring i'm excited it's officially sp it's getting warm little by little i'm looking forward to the next few weeks when i can shed myself off the old jacket the old fucking you know it's it's whatever man i'm over it i'm over it i'm looking forward to new spring new summer season coming around and spicing things up changes in the air changes in your pocket changes literally everywhere man your asshole is surrounded by a lot of hair. Lick it, I will, should you dare. Your mom and dad have kinky sex and I don't care. It's just something I want to let you know. And neither should you, man. If your mom and dad are having kinky sex, that is just, that's actually good for them. I'm happy for your mom and dad. You know what I mean? Because like, I'm happy for anybody's mom and dad who are just like, fucking it's, it's go time. Because that's how you keep the relations going. But that's what it is when you're when you're younger you're like man that's something you don't talk about something you don't see hopefully you don't talk about it hopefully you don't see it but you do want it to be happening in the background you don't ever want to talk about it but you got to talk about it just so it happens because you got to make sure it happens that's how parentals that's how couples stay together but it's so it's easy for us to remove ourselves from that like oh man i'm not you know that's a it's different to look at parentals or like grown-ups coming up as a young and you don't i don't even know what i'm saying but i'm just saying i'm in support of families that's what i'm saying that's what i know and i don't know much god i don't know much i don't know anything it's uh but that's what that's the beauty of this why would you want you know that's what I, i've come up to uh, many of different conclusions none leading me to anywhere specific but conclusions nonetheless and one of the conclusions why would you want like full fucking you know, why would you want like an expert in like any field? Really, it's bullring. Oh, you got a doctor that knows everything? Bullring. You got, you got some peanut? You got some peanuts? You got some penis? It's court time, baby. You got some penis? Some penis? Some penis? Some penis. Some penis. So, you know, a little bit of penis here, a little bit of penis there. Here, there, everywhere. It's penis. You want to get lawyered up. Why would you go with a lawyer that knows everything? You want to go with a lawyer that's got room to improve. Sure, your case might not go well. Sure, you might even lose. Sure, you might be seeing, you know, whatever. You learn from it. And, and they too learn from it too. Whereas like, oh, I'm a doctor that knows all the body parts. I'm a doctor that knows all the body parts. I paid attention in an anatomy class. I know biologies. Oh... The heart's got to be beating for it to be working. Oh, Mr. Know-it-all. Heart's got to be beating for everything to be. It's like, you know, but where's the magic in that? Where's the, where's the room for surprise? Where's the room for trial and error? Ever do an operation and stitch a bad boy up, but leave no utensils behind a bow rank? Talk about a, you know what I mean? Like an infection that you'd have to go back two, three weeks. I'm not feeling too well. As a matter of fact, it's taking a turn for the worse. It's, oh man, my appendix this is bulging right there fucking bulging and you're like you know what let's let's cut you open again you know measure twice cut once boring lame 
Fuck measurements. You know, that's, that's the problem these days. Too many measurements. Too many, and everybody measures, baby. It's like, eyeball it. Every once in a while, it is good to be like, hey, do you need a spleen removed? Uh, do you even need that clavicle, son? You know what I'm talking about? Just take it out. Experiment. Experiment, because that's what, that's what we did. And that's how you got the best medication. That's how you got the best doctors. Dog, when you, when you got too much, too much access to everything, where it's like, oh, where you don't gotta go dig up your own corpses, like they did back in to do research, when it's just like free bodies, just for you to dissect and oh man, the worst day, you know, that's what a, a doctor was somebody who'd be willing to go get his hands dirty and I'm not, I'm not, I'm not advocating that, but I'm just saying like, you know, you got your hands dirty, there was something to it or not. Who knows? We've come a long way, but I'm just saying, you know, it's good to, you know, all don't, you know, a contractor that wants to build your house. You know what I mean? Oh, everything's got to be, you know, dimensions and square footage. <laughs> got to have a permit to work in this real It's like, why? You know, just start digging. What happened to just start digging? Because like, you know, you think the, the you, great, the, the great buildings get built because they took exact measurements and work. You know, is this ground level? Should we do we want to build on this ground even? You know, like that's famous Tower of Pisa or Pisa in Italy, slanted a bit like a nice little. You know what I'm talking about? But it's natural. The curvature is natural. It leans to the left or right. I don't know which way it leans, but it's natural. That's fine. That's fine. How did they do it? The original lean with a lock, rock with it. Lean with it, lock with it. So you, you lean with it, you lock with it too. You lean and you, you lean in and lock in. Lock, lean and pop, lock and lock in, people. I don't even know what I'm saying. Boys and girls, it's Wednesday. We're about to have some fun. We are having some fun. And it's all about, you know, doing different things. Experimenting. Because hey, you can always stick to the same old scent. You can always stick to the same old car air refreshner but this spring this summer it's time to switch it up it's time to switch it up as a matter of fact i've gone ahead and switched a bunch of things up i'm thinking of producing some sort of coming out with a brand of lube where it is extremely difficult to wash off let that let that just let that let that just fucking what did you even hear right now what did you even hear right now what just happened you know what i mean take it all in take it all in What's going on here? It's cray cray, isn't it? I know. Loop that doesn't wash away easy. What happened here? Oh my god, let me let, let's let's just let's just have that sink in for a second. Can can we just cause a lot of times we don't let things just sink in. Just let us sink in for a second. You know what I'm talking about? Just Letting it just sometimes just good to let things sink in. When was the last time you let it sink in? You sunk in, baby. Loop that's difficult to wash off. Sinking. Sinking. But let it sink in even more. Sinking. I'm sinking. Let it sink more, baby. Fucking let it sink. Loop. It's extremely difficult to wash off sinking. Uh, and this is as far as I've sunk. I'm okay. Now that you've successfully let that thought sink in. Cause it's easy to like it's easy to like get lost in the moment and then like be like, yeah, let's let's you know let's get easy wash it like you know, easy rinse quick in and out fast washable removable rinse it off with just a splash of spit or water lube why if you're gonna be back at it again why think about that think about the sicko look right that the sicko look right there is that the sicko look right that the if you're gonna be coming back fat why would you want that shit to be rinsed off easily at it and that's what it is, man. That's how Big Lube gets you, fam. They put it on the table. Man. Oh, man. This place is a little bit dusty. But that's what it is, baby. We keep the dust for the 
It's time to do it. I will clean up and I have cleared. It's, it gets dusty. Because why? It's been cold. Once it gets cold, the windows are shut. Balcony doors are shut. The heaters are running. You're on the top of, you know, you're on one of the, you're up there. All the air through the ventilation system gets, you know, and I'm, I'm essentially collecting skin particles from every unit, little by little. And that's how I build my immune system, ladies and gentlemen, through just breathing in everybody's little dermis. A little bit of your, little bit of your dermis goes a long way for this guy, but that's, let's not get sidetracked. I am so over getting sidetracked. Here's, here's sidetracked. You won't even see me near sidetrack. I we used to do sidetracking on your boy. He used to be tight, but then sidetracking start acting. I'm like, nah, -uh, not here. So, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, let me just say, extremely difficult loop to wash off your body because again, it's all about the message. You want to go out there the next day with a couple of loose buttons hair a little bit just fluffed up missing an eyebrow missing a tooth what happened last night jimmy oh what happened last night jimmy i wonder what happened last night? you know boy had a little bit of fun with the missus that's what happened you're still glistening need i say more glistening let the glistening do the yappity yap for you because uh, a lot of times the people want to yappity yappa for them but they don't want to let the lube do the yappity yap for them. Dude. And that's messaging again. I'm thinking this product will be a game changer. And the game is changing. The game is constantly changing. We are, we are changing the game with extremely difficult fucking... The viscosity up in this bitch when you put that lube on so like it's just gonna be like we're not getting in anything and if we do we ain't getting out that's how you want it because a lot of times they're like oh get this lube it's the most slipperiest what about the most viscous what about something that's just like fucking thick dude I'm goopy drippity drip drip extremely difficult fit you know Forget it, it will ruin your bed sheets. Yes, of course. Is it worth it? Yes, of course. Why not? When, you know, because it's easy to, for you to be like, why? But again, I say, why not? I say, why? When you, when you go into a meeting the next day, John, when you are wearing a white dress shirt with a nice tie, but you can still see because it's summertime now, and you, st you see patches of oil seeping through your skin on the derma because it's a thick layer on your skin, which has not been easily wiped away. Thank you very much. And it's now seeping through your white dress shirt as you're in the meeting. What will they think? What will all the staff member, the employees, the managerial sect, upper management, Double upper management. Management so up high. You don't even know they're there, man. Upper man, the kind of management that's just floating, fucking like they got helium in their gas tank, baby. It's fucking up on the ceiling. Sometimes you don't even know what's going on. They're like, man, how do they keep control, man? It's top to bottom, right? So you gotta, like, if you wanna be effective, you gotta get that guy's attention. And nothing gets that guy's attention. Like a little patch of just goopity goop goop. Oily patch, you know what it is? And he knows what it is because he's on it too. Guess what? Guess what's dripping on you? His extremely hard to remove body lube oil. This essential oils. Scented oils? Yeah, we make it scented. How long does it last? As long as you want. Did you ever want to just like Ever play around with one of those little, like, little, I don't even know what they're called. What are those little things that you play with? It's like a little putty. It's like a little, it's not like silly putties, but it's like putty and you're supposed to use it to clean the keyboard. Clean the fucking, like, you know, 
uh, is your remote dirty? Just like rub that, and then eventually it accumulates all the dirt. First, it's like, oh, this is so fun, and then that next thing you know, a few years goes by, and you got this piece of turd in your hand, and you're like, oh, if I roll this piece of turd everywhere, it collects all the dust and gunk and all the garbage. I just clean around my teeth with it. You know what I mean? Just like everywhere, you put it in one ear, it comes out the other side, but your ears clean now, fam. Is it all sorts of colors, textures? Yes. Is it wet but dry all at the same time? Yes. How? How? Hmm. Huh. You know? Happens. I'm saying something like that, but for lube. So that you can go around and it's like multi-purpose. I'm sick and tired of things having only one purpose. I'm sick and tired of things having only one as a matter of fact if you are coming out with something that's only singular in purpose i want to hear about it i don't want to hear about it anymore man i want to hear about it because single purposed items are like what are we you know because it's like 2023 and you're supposed to be multi-purpose multi-lanes multi-levels Stacking and spreading, spreading and stacking and expanding. And you can't do that with the one single purpose thing, whatever it may be the thing that's the thing that you thought that what? You know? So let us have a little bit of fun in the bedroom, if we may, and also be able to go out to the office. Collect a little bit of, you know, oh, let me, let me get your, let me get that keyboard, Nance. Just fucking start rolling over that keyboard. Sit on your, you know, when was the last time your boss was given a speech, speechin', public speechin', because your boss loves to speech. And you just go and sit on his lap, but not for anything, you know, for the sake of letting him, let me get that lint off your overcoat, sir. Just as he's speaking, he's giving a full out fucking, it's like, we're going to hit this quarter. And, that's what, and once we hit that quarter, dude, guess what we're going to, we're going to come back from behind and start hitting the other quarter. Fucking, because this quarter has been going strong. And you just want to fucking, you know, because that's what we do with yearly quarters, man. You want to get there. You want to get there, but you want to get there fun. You want to get there fast. You want to take it slow, but not too slow. And that's what I'm saying. Maybe difficult. Just a, just a lube that's like try washing me off. You can go go ahead and try washing me off. Cause like reg lube. Oh, let me get you a tissue. Let me get a napkin. Ah, uh, yeah, boring, lame. And again, what is it? Single use, fam. That's how they get you. Next thing you know, you've spent five, ten. You know, blink of an eye, 30 years goes by just like that. How much money did you spend on lube? You didn't think of it when you were all caught up in the moment. Oh, I'll just wipe this off right now. No big deal. Wipe it off and just toss it away. I'm not going to think about this. One time use. When was the last time you were able to put any sort of moisture on your body and have it last for decades? That's what, that's what, we, that's what we need to go back to, man. If making things that are multi-purpose and also fucking everlasting something that if you want to get rid of it it's going to take a whole friggin army of armies with like x ray vision goggles and zappity zap laser guns to be like oh my god we're gonna have to fucking nuke this thing for it to like you know melt away or like send it away to space you know let's let's you know and we could do that every 10 years and that's how you make extra we need we need the extra jobs every 10 years we come out with dudes and ladies who have scrapers body scrapers and they'll come and scrape your body with this fat layer of lard that's been sitting, assisting you. And you're not, not just your love life, but in cleaning and making friends and leaving you and leaving marks behind. So it's easy for you. To, so it's actually, you know what, there is going to be, are you, you know, having a difficult time, like remembering where things are, leave a little bit of like trail of goop behind just a little bit of sticky icky from your body, just drip baby. Everywhere you go, just drip, drip, drip. And forget about GPS, forget about like, oh, I gotta know the address. Do you though? Do you though? Just imagine my, both of my legs right now wrapped around my neck, cause I could, if 
I were that flexible, and I am, but for the sake of keeping this a family fucking all the way around the neck, all the way around the fucking neck, dude. I'm doing it, I'm doing it. Oh, but I'm not about to, you know. Please do not try this at home. The moves you see here are crafted with years of Cirque du Soleil, watching Cirque du Soleil, practicing Cirque du Soleil, uh, not participating in Cirque du Soleil, but nonetheless, did my flexibility, did it all, was it, it, it did I get inspired? Is it good to look at men and women who are extremely flexible, uh, fucking buoyant, dealing with all sorts of animals, but in a fun way? Yeah, yeah. Is it inspiring? Yeah. You know? So you're like, how did you go ahead and wrap both of your feet around your neck just right now? Watch the video. You can do it too. You can do it too every morning, every single day. I wrap both, I bring both, it's just, you know, I, it, it didn't always start off like what it just looked like right now. I wasn't always capable of wrapping both my legs around, around, you just bring, you gotta just like, it's all, a li do your bones crack a little bit? Yes. Will your joints hurt a little bit? Yes. Is it gonna hurt? Absolutely. We're, we're, is, is there gonna be any pain? Is there gonna be any blood involved? If, if there's no pain, if there's no blood, is it even fun? Is it even worth doing? So that's, and at the end of the day, I'm also thinking of coming out with a new, cause I'm tired of regular joints. I'm not talking about the smokable ones. Those are like, those are, that, that will always stay intact and in our heart, man, where it belongs. But I'm talking about regular joints. Fuck regular joints. I'm talking about your wrist. I'm talking about your elbows. I'm talking about your knees. Fuck that. Fuck it. It's it's lame. Regular. Oh, oh, oh this. Uh, you know. That, oh, 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 right there. Uh, that's all I can do. Right there. Uh, oh, you know. And what is this? What is this? How come it goes like this, but doesn't fucking go the other? You know what I mean? It can. I I could do this, but it, I can't just fucking like you know. And hence, say goodbye to your old joints, ladies and gents. Introducing the all the multi all time. Fuck, it's the multi-purpose, all-time, best of the best. I'm, 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 I'm thinking of calling it like a hyper-flexible joints. Super hyper-flexible joints. Get the new hyper-flexible joints for your old squeaky weird fucking joints that only go like this. Ah, fucking like, you know what I mean? It should have been the design is flawed in the sense that it doesn't fucking like, I, if I want it to be 90 degrees pointing down this away, why not? I imagine my life often uh, being completely different were I able to, but now we can. Yes, we can, ladies. And just like a few minutes ago, you saw me wrap both of my feet around my neck. Anything is possible. <coughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm thinking we do... Again, this is innovation, this is science, this is fucking new age. This is fucking synth wave right now. Retro synth wave science. Balls, right? Just balls instead of your weird fucking joints that only like goes, ah, uh, uh, yuck. It makes me wanna fucking throw up. And I have been throwing up as soon as I found out that I can't go more than, why? If you're gonna, if you're, this is all I can do. I can't fucking go the other way. You know, it's same with the Legos. Same with the Legos, fam. You can always like, you know, you can always kick, you can always kick your heel to the back of your ass, but you can't tap yourself with your toes on the tip of your peen. And if I can't tap the tip of my peen with the tip of my toes, then I don't even know what I'm doing around here, man. It's, you know, it's like, yeah, yeah. Some of us spend time inventing the Apple Macintosh, the Mac Apple, the Mac daddy of all apples. Some people look at an apple so long, they take a bite out of it and it's infused with, with all sorts of acid maybe and then you start tripping and then years go by. Tens of thousands of businesses fail. People come into your life, people go out of your life, you collaborate, you, 
What ifs? Apple Macintosh. Some people do that. Macintosh. And I want to bring that word back, by the way. Too many people are just like, oh, Mac. Macintosh. Okay? It's like, why do we need to take it? It's sometimes say the full thing. Say the full thing. Is that a new Apple Macintosh? Yes, it is a new Apple Macintosh. Let it sink in, baby. Just fucking let it sink in. Sinking? Sinking. Sinking further. Maximum sinking. Achieved. And that's how you let ideas sink in. Point is, ladies and gentlemen, that uh, I'm tired of regular joints. I'm tired of being made a fool of. Every time I want to be able to just fucking... Yes, is it good to be able to walk straight? Absolutely. But is it like also fun to be able to like, have your knees be able to rotate 360? What about your neck, fam? What about your neck? What is this? What is, what is this? What is this? We got robots and language learning models doing fucking all sorts of human activities and we're stuck with this regular shit right here? No more, fam. Starting next week, I will sit here and have my entire neck rotate fucking 360, 180 at least. Because right now, this is like, you know, it's, I'm over it. I'm over it. I'm going full rotation. I'm going full rotation, and that's what it did. We're doing a full 360. Will it hurt again? Yes. But this is again limiting, 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 limit. You know, like you should be able to like just on every joint, even your fingers. Imagine all your fingers and, and the joints. They had little circle, little. So it's just a teeny tiny little procedure that we're gonna have to undergo together. Okay. I'm thinking that's the that's the next move, because frankly, if I'm being completely honest with you, it's it's time that we 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 take things into our own hands. It's time that we go back to the roots of uh, medicine, back to the roots of experimenting, back to the roots of trees, back to the roots of plants back to the roots of turnips and fucking carrots and shit too you know back to the roots or something boys and girls ladies and gentlemen i hope you let those sink in for a second while i get a sip of this Cause a lot of times you want to be a dumb, you know, you want to be, a, oh, you're as serious as a fool of boy. You're as serious as a fool boy is what, you know, is what it is, what it is, is what it is. Cause a lot of times we just want to be like, let me stick to the, let me, let me, I know how to do the old one, two step. I know how to, I know how to take one step at a time. And that's fine and dandy, but sometimes you just got to be like, you know what? You know what, fam? If I had little balls on every joint, I could just, I could, you could go fucking, instead of walking upright, which is cool. If you had balls on your kneecaps. On the bottom of your feet, on the tip of your toes, balls everywhere. Balls is the future, man. That's what I, you know, that's just like a little, because you could just like, like lie down like a flat little, like you could just plank. And if you got a couple of balls, a rotating couple of balls here, and you could just, if it's downhill, baby, we're, forget about the bus, forget about getting a cab, forget about driving a vehicle. Just get on your, get on, you just lie down on the floor, just be stiff. Just make sure to stay stiff slide down and you could even couples how romantic is that two couples just fucking planking on top of one another going downhill 
and you don't, and you don't, because like right now, if you do it, you could do it, and I don't, you know, I'm not saying don't. Now you do it, you can like, you know, you scrape off the whole fucking layer of skin, and you're gonna be like, you know, it's all fun and games until you scrape off a whole bunch of skin, and then you're like, oh man, we should have really opted for those balls in our in our joints and like, you know. And, and it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna make that, it's gonna be difficult for that because, like, how do you decide who's gonna be the, who's gonna be bottom today, who's gonna be riding tops? Do you split that responsibility? Because I do get it. Like, if you do want to, and if you're rolling around with no balls on your joints, you're gonna be getting scraped, son, lady. But avoid all of that. If you, if you're still again, you're, you're on the fence. You're like, I don't know about this ball and the joints, man. Sounds really futurism. Sounds like retro futurism. Sounds like futuristic retro shit. Sounds like future shit. Sounds like it's the future. And I'm saying it's the future now. I'm saying it's the future now. Future's got balls in your joints. And if you're not ready for that, well, at least indulge in the extremely viscous loop so that when you are sliding, you don't feel a goddamn thing. And what is it? It's again, it's been a whole season of fall, winter, splish, splash, sploosh. Uh, you, you got gunk on the street. We're gonna have to send people in cars with fucking cool little brushes that are attached and are brushing in circular motions and are just cleaning up the streets. Sure, we could do it uh, that way. We could hire people to send a car that's got little brushes that do circular motions for the cleaning of the streets and the sidewalks. Yes, does it work? Yes, are people hired? Yes, is the city working? Yes, are people, you know, but do you wanna, again, do things with a single purpose? or knock a whole bunch of birds down with barely even any stones. Create your own stones. Shoot a fucking kidney stone out of your urethra to take out multiple birds. That's the way our ancestors did it. That's the way I recommend doing it. Going back to nature and trying to use your own resources, man. Because everybody, it's, 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 you know, some people are like, man, I don't know how to start. You want to take out some birds, you got to get some rocks, do ya? Do ya, son? Or is it just a, or is it just a little bit of, you know, does it take a little bit of determination on your part to be like, you know what, I'm going to put in the time, I'm going to put in the effort, poor diet. I'm going to get myself dehydrated. Uh, just, you know, I don't even know what causes kidney stones, but that's the thing because we, that's the, you know, use it or lose it. That's what's happened here, fam. Use it or lose it. Use it or lose it. And that's what's happened to the kidney stone, man. How do you think our great, 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 great grandparents or whatever went around fighting off saber-toothed tigers, the woolly mammoth, that now we're, you know, our great, 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 great ancestors had to sit down go through a lifestyle of poor nutrition not enough water probably a little bit chilly at nighttime it'd be chilly almost everywhere without all the amenities that we got it'd be chilly but then they, they were like i'm going to stay determined and fucking what do they do they sat around months in pain creating their own little rock from their body gave birth to it bled and then took out that rock and bloody rock in one hand bloody peen in the other and you're like, which one do I attend to first? Does it even matter at this point? Is it even a peen once it's ripped? Look at the size of this rock that came out of this peen. But then your great, 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 great grandpa went out into the into the night of the into the dark of the night. You could say he was the original fucking dark knight. Went out there, man, just fucking chucked right there. And that's how we took care of the whole woolly mammoth problem. One fucking individual decided that you know what these rocks that are lodged into the mountains and shit we still not got any tools to break these down what am i gonna do fam am i gonna sit here and cry because i don't have access to these people lost many a teeth trying to bite off rocks so that they can lodge it just fucking lodge it at a tiger or a fucking woolly mammoth but no 
too difficult. Often we had many of people lose their lives because they were like grabbing onto a rock, trying to like peel it off. Once then the tiger's fucking right there, the woolly mammoth is right there, right? Just breathing, breathing, saliva, mucus. It's got saliva, it's got mucus. Guess who else is fucking saliva up and mucusy a little bit too? You're crying, your great, 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 great grandpa, ma, ma, maybe grandma, fucking, you know? snot fest trying to rip off a little rock and then that's eventually it's like just like through the orals we learn that you know sometimes it's good to make your own rock sometimes it's good because that's and that's how we made fire a couple of fellas again it took years of poor nutrition lack of water having to bleed through their pee hole right in the dick hole bleeding God, bleeding, just bleeding, bleeding, bleeding from the dick hole until a couple of rocks fell out. And then, you know, after a little while, you, you know, you shed a couple of tears, but then you realize there's no, there's no crying over spilt milk. And that's not even something they had knowledge of. So they were like crying over spilt, whatever is spilt, you know, bladder juice. No point of crying over spilt bladder juice, a mixture of urine and blood. No point. Does it hurt? Yes. But let's make, let's, let's have a little bit of fun. And that's what they did, man. They grabbed their two rocks. Each of them, the, the, the boys and the, the men's and the ancestrals. And they're like, you know what? Let's destroy these rocks. I'll grab a rock. You grab a rock. And we're going to smash these rocks as a symbolic representation of us not only conquering ourselves, our inner rocks, but also nature, you're not gonna make me, you're not gonna, you're, you're not gonna take us down as they were hunched over in pain. You're not gonna take us down, man. Let's smash these rocks together and show mother nature who's in, you know, who's in some, who's in charge like five, two, 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 two to three percent at a time. And that little by little, and look how many percentages we got now, like a lot more, right? But that's what it is, it took the rocks Went for a smashy poo, a little smashy poo on the rocks. Sparks went off, fire, fire. Again, the first individuals burnt, burnt marks everywhere. First, second, and third degree. Because you have now fire, you're excited, but you're burning. Having never experienced fire, burning. God, they burnt and burnt, but also, you know, the others saw something there. And again, we had, we, uh, it took a long time for people to figure out, man, like, do not stick your hand in the, but at least we got, that's how we came up with the spark of the fire. That's what it is, man. So I'm tired of just like, you know, we're changing things up around here. I'm tired of people like doing the talk, but not, I'm not, you know, not, if you're going to be like, oh, I'm a deadlifter, I'm going to just, I'm just going to be like deadlifting all day, dude. Cause that's, that's like one of the core exercises and I'm going to be, but I've yet to see somebody actually fucking pull up a, just a just a dead corpse and do deadlifts, you know, all talk, all talk. I do, I do my deadlifts. Where though, fam? Where? Is there even a facility for all these people to be doing deadlifts? Think about that. But a lot of people like to hype it up and say that one of the most amazing exercises for the legs or what, or the or the overall they say if you're going to do one thing do deadlifts and they talk about it they they write about it they they parade about it they they've got shows about it written books about it, movies and songs about the deadlift yet i've seen zero actual lifting of the dead fam What is that? What is that? And then when, when do we when do we stop to look around and be like, okay, when does it when does it all, you know? Because there's one second you're saying you're doing something, not doing it, and everybody's like, yeah. Yeah. Those are sweet dad lifts, man. Yet again, no no body. Insight whatsoever. This fella's just fucking work around a couple of dumbbells dumbbells if they're so dumb that why are they cooperating all of a sudden leaving you 
all to yourself to lift them up and down so you can pray it around and be like, I've done deadlifts with these dumbbells. Are they that dumb? Are they that, or are they just playing dumb? It's exposure time now. Watch me wrap both of my feet around my neck one more time. Just like that. So, and my four firearms, you tell me, do people have the right to have cool arms? Fucking bunch of litty fucking arms, dude, and my four firearms. I've ne you know, that's what it is, because you know, you can see a see a fella or a lady who's got fucking firearms all day every day man like man i don't think people should have firearms i don't believe in arms being cool i don't believe in arms being lit i don't believe in arms being dope no firearms and then all of a sudden everybody starts you know mm. Arms get, arms become all like lame and fucking like, you know, boring and shit. Why? It's all about the messaging. It's all about the messaging. It's getting really dark, by the way. Dark clouds are looming, ladies and gentlemen. Dark clouds are looming ahead or, or away. Or going around really, because it's getting, it's fucking, it's a sphere. We're in, a, we're in a sphere, but it is got it's getting dark and it's morning time, but it is getting dark and it reminds me of the times that it got dark in the morning time and you know are again with no electricity with no God it was difficult times back then uh, I, I'd imagine I'd imagine but also like if you like you know if you cracked open a lion's skull and now you're munching on like lion thigh and nothing else to do but to munch on lion thighs you know you're kind of sweet not gonna lie not gonna lie baby boys baby girls i don't know if it's getting recorded or not but in the distance i hear a thunder I hear a thunder it's gonna be a thunderstorm it's gonna be raining. It is gonna be raining. But that's what it is, baby. It's April showers brings what? It's not flowers. There it is. Did you guys hear that? Or maybe it is flowers, but did you hear that? You hear the rumbling? They used to say those are, you know, that's just, those are the gods having some diarrhea. They used to say that. It used to be like, they used to look up in the sky and be like, the gods are having IBS, man. You know, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. But at the end of the day, we figured it out by sending people up there. And it was difficult in the beginning to send people up there without the actual, because like, it's easy to go up there now. We've been up there. We keep going up there. We're going up there again, apparently, soon times, way up there. But, you know, try doing that with just uh just a fucking, you know, a loincloth around your waist and just a desire to fly. Just a desire and the, the willingness to be like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna flap these wings when, when you had no wings. But flap nonetheless, you flapped and you flapped and you flapped, son. Whoa, lightning bolts are going off in the distance. You guys can't see it. I'm gonna have to describe it for you. It's very, if I were to describe a lightning bolt, you guys hear that, ladies and gents? If I were to describe a lightning, I'd say it has the attributions of a zigzag pattern, you could say. Non-linear, one would say. Which, which is how I like my lightning. Because it'd be boring if, if lightning struck and it was just like one straight line. Again, what is it? Not single-purpose. Lightning is multi-purposed. Hence, be like lightning. Touch lightning, touch lightning. A lot of people say, don't we know it's raining? 
Don't go outside and touch lightning. Why? Could it be that they want all the lightning for themselves? Could it be that they want all the lightning for themselves? Think about that. Because you've never seen anybody run head first until today, ladies and gentlemen. As soon as this lightning shower gets going, I'm going to run straight, or maybe not, but... Is, do things need to be questioned? Yes. Should we try the yes? Because why stick with the same thing? When you can be like lightning. Baby boys, baby girls, ladies and gentlemen, I love you. Thank you for all the love and support. If you like these videos and you want to see more of it, where can you find them? Every Monday, Wednesday, Friday on Instagram. Follow me there if you like. Check out YouTube by searching Rob Sadry or Glad You Made It. Hit that subscribe button. Hit it, hit it, hit it tight. It's like, oh, we're just, uh, hit it with a baseball bat or get romantic with it. Buy a dinner, take it home, play a little bit of music and then hit it. Fuck it, yeah, yeah, yeah. This, this, this is you. This here's the subscribe button. Look how much you like it and look how much the subscribe button likes it. So subscribe. That gets recorded, right? You guys hear that, right? Lightning strikes again. Mondays, Wednesdays, Fridays. Instagram, YouTube, patreon.com slash Rob Sadry. Subscribe, follow if you like. Support us fiscally if you like to see the show grow. And my next goal will be to surpass my already extremely flexible limits. Not only will I wrap my, I've already gone ahead and wrapped my feet around my neck. That's the next goal is to fucking rotate back all the way back down. That's maybe, I, I think a couple of weeks of just strength core training will get us there. I'll be back here again very soon. Have a lot of fun. Love you all. Talk soon. Peace out.